What's going on, everybody? Kenny Bomb is in the building, and I finally did it. I finally got full mastery with Cyrax. It should have been done a long time ago, but better late than never, right? Now, Noob Cybot definitely has the best gear in the game. Ermax comes very close, but I think Noob Cybot beats him out by a small margin. The question today is, can Cyrax come close or match the quality we got with Noob Cybot? It's time to jump in here and find out. But first, shout out to WB for sending me this game for free. And shout out to y'all for watching this video. Let's get into it. Run, run, boy. They're coming now. Run, run, boy. They're coming now. So this is actually going to be my first time seeing Cyrax gear. I see people post it on X a lot, but I always avoid looking at them until we get in here and do these reviews. So let's go ahead and select Cyrax. And as y'all can see, it's untouched right now. So we'll go ahead and start off with the gear pieces. So, you know what, let's look at our original gear piece first. Well, I was trying to zoom out on it, but I guess we can't do that until we actually get to the palettes. But the mask actually looks really good. I think this was a perfect reimagining of the Cyrax look. And it looks like a woman's mask, so I think they did a good job with it. I like how the back actually looks like dreadlocks, but again, it really looks like it's just something you can actually plug into. So, you know what, I'm going to give the new mask a 10 out of 10. Perfect look for Cyrax as a woman. Let's look at the palace first before we get to the next one. Okay, I like that. I like that. The white, okay. Like a creamish off-white. That's a nice one, too. Uh, this one. Oh, not really too crazy about this one. It's like a clay-colored black or something. Uh, not too crazy on that one. This one's a little too harsh. It looks like a player two outfit. Okay, I like the purple. I like the purple. And the last one, this is good. I like this one too. I would have probably changed that tealish green a different color, but I like how the purple accent works with it. So I'm going to give that one a pass too. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at our second gear. Whoa, they took all of the sparkle things off? Oh, well. So just off of the first look. Whoa, come on now. I'm not too crazy on this one. This reminds me of those, um, what was it, like Cold War mask or whatever you had in Mortal Kombat X. Hated them. Let's see how it looks with the different palettes. Mm, just really don't like that mask too much. To the point where I think I'm going to drop it at a 5 out of 10. That might be the lowest we got to a gear piece that we've looked at on one of these videos. I just really don't like that mask. Too bulky. I don't like the little gas mask looking things on the side of it. So this one, uh, not a W for me. Now this one, I think I can actually get with it. All right. I like to see her face out at the bottom. I actually like how her face model looks in this as well. Hopefully we get her unmasked here. I didn't see if we had that option or not. Those little things on her head look like the... um. What part of the computer is that you plug into? I think Is that the Wi-Fi part? I think that's the Wi-Fi adapter where you plug in and they got kind of got the cords like that. But I like this one. Let's see how it looks with the palettes. Okay. So I think this is probably going to be my favorite uh, palette out of all of hers. That white's a bit much. This one's actually not bad with this mask on. Mm, still, a too, still a bit too harsh on this green. I like purple, so I'm, I think I'm going to like all of these purples too. What about this one? Ah, the yellow being washed a little bit. It's like somebody dropped some... Whoa, let's see her face in this. Is this like a... um? Oh, this is the Havoc palette? Oh, okay, this is the Chaos palette. I see. So with this one, you know what? Definitely, I'm going to say this is the best look on it. I'm going to go this. I'm going to go with the base color. So this one, I'll go 8 out of 10. I'm going to go 8 out of 10, but it's, nah, it, it looks good. I'm going to go 8 out of 10. Okay, we got a little samurai looking mask. Ah, Shirai Ryu is what they label it. Okay, I like this one. I like this one. I like how they show the face at the bottom. 
Well, let's see how the palettes look. I'm sure those the color of those eyes are going to change, but I do like them green. Ooh, that looks really good, in fact. That looks really good. This might be my favorite so far. Oh, yeah, definitely, most definitely. If we're not going base Cyrax, we're definitely going this one. This is a 10 out of 10. Ooh, even this one's looking good. Oh. Yep, so this would probably be, this is my new base. Right now, we're sticking with this one. Yep, I think I'm sticking with that one. So, so far, we're going to be leaving Cyrax like this. But Oh, we got the classic mask. Okay, so for the people who want the old Cyrax back, we got the old-looking dreadlocks back with the beads on the bottom of them. This actually translates pretty well. Let's look at it with a few pallets on. Whoa, I didn't select it. Let's see it with a few of the pallets. That looks real good. It looks really good. I can already tell you this one's getting a 10 out of 10. She do got kind of a big head with this one, though, but <laughs> I like it. Um, I, I don't know. I got like a hate love with this white. It, it's like too much. I wish they put some more black on the legs or something, but I'm going to say with this one, I like it. This one as well. I don't like the color of that black too much that they used. Cause it's like a greenish black, but I do like it. This one is never going to win for me. Uh, I just don't, that color is kind of too harsh. The purple, I do like the purple. I haven't seen one of the purples that I would actually put on her though. Oh, this one looks really good on this. Is this the best one? No, I might go, I might go base in fact. I think I might go base, but this one gets a 10 out of 10 stamp, too. All right, let's check the next one. This looks like, oh. I don't like it. Why do we have to give her hair like this? I mean, come on. She could have had She could have had oh, Come on. I don't like it. It looks like somebody's auntie's grandma. That's like auntie. That's like auntie hairstyle. Don't like the hair. They should have let us. Give us some options. I actually do like the, I like the mask. And I like to see her head out, but. Come on, man. We could have done better with the hair. Y'all just don't understand. If, if <laughs> this is 100% auntie. My auntie. R.I.P. to her, but <laughs> this is how she had her hair. And you really don't see, you really don't see black women rocking this. Not even in Africa. Maybe some of them, but they usually got their hair done up. Now this one just looks like a big old shell. Like, what is this? <laughs> looks like some type of motorcycle mask. Uh, I don't like this one. How can she see? Does she have something in there that's kind of like reading the environment for her? This one covers up too much of the face. Ah, it's too much. Four out of ten. Four out of ten. And you know what? I'm going to give this one the aunt, uh, the auntie skin right here. It could have been good. I'm going to give it a six out of ten. Because it could have been good if they did something different with her hair. Same with this one. I don't like that hair at all. Not one bit. Now, I know Sector has short hair too. So, I'm sure this is just a Lin Kuei thing where they cut the hair to make sure it's not in the way. But... I don't like how it looks. Again, Auntie vibes. She got the Super Saiyan scouter on her face. Not Super Saiyan. I guess they dropped them when they got became Super Saiyans. But yeah, Vegeta came to Earth and he used to have them on back then. Oh, it's like two tone. It's purple right there. Then it turns yellow. All right, nice detail. Again, another one I do like, but I wish she had like a ponytail or something at the top. You could have gave her a man bun, just like Scorpion and Sub Zero. I mean, I guess it would be a woman bun at that point because she's a woman, but it, it's too auntie. It's too auntie vibes. Too much auntie for me. Four out of ten. We'll go six out of ten because it could have been good if she had a ponytail or something. Or they could have just gave her the dreadlocks that they always give the, um, the black woman. Like, give her the Jackie, Jackie Briggs dreadlocks. Ooh, okay. This kind of looks like an evil-looking Cyrax. 
All right, I like it from front to back. It looks good. All right, so it looks like we got a good one here. I wonder, do we get Sector unmasked? Now I'm interested to see how she looks like fully. I've seen the fatal blow with the short haircut, but I wonder if we got her unmasked as well. This one, you know what? Mm, I, I'm actually going to go 7 out of 10. It's giving me kind of Iron Man vibes. I guess I was about to say why she's not red. I, it's Sector. It would have been the same as Sector if she could have gone red. But I will probably go with this one if I had to choose one of these. So, yeah, we're going to stick that one at a 7 out of 10. And last, but is it least, uh, it's, it's too futuristic, too, too spacey. They went too spacey with these Cyrax masks. She's got a few really good ones, but overall, definitely not even coming close to the quality we got with the Noob Cybot or Ermac. Uh, same with this one. I think the space vibes do look good with the teal and purple colors on them. So this one, I'll stick it there at a 7 out of 10 as well. It's not super offensive. I just really don't like the Starship Trooper look. All right, and there we go for Cyrax. So base mask, 100%. This one is a 10 out of 10. I like this one. I wish they kind of opened her face up like they have it opened on this one, but still had her head covered on the top. But this one's really good. This is another 10. You know what? This one, I will say, is the best. Unless you like classic Cyrax and you want to go with this one, then that's a 10 out of 10. But we are getting up out of here with our Cyrax looking like this. What do y'all think? Let me know what y'all think about Cyrax gear. I'm going to jump in here right now because I don't got nothing else to do tonight. So I can actually get some things done with Sector. So I'm going to get to it. Bomb Squad, shouts out to WB for sending me a free copy of this. Let's get to that.